What's up guys, it's July 12, 2011, this is One Question a Day and I am Pete Moss. Alright, today's question is about Netflix and other streaming sites, uh, Amazon, Hulu, whoever it may be, and do you use Netflix and how do you feel about the price increase? Now because of Ty, we, you know, I guess I get some kind of a discount, I don't pay for my Netflix, maybe he pays for it. But I have the basic streaming account, actually I signed in through Ty's, <laughs> but anyway I have the basic streaming account and what I, from what I read, that package and with the one one at a time DVD unlimited, but you only get one at a time is going to go from like right at ten bucks to sixteen dollars, fifteen ninety eight a month. That's a pretty big increase. Uh, and where do you watch your streaming movies from? Do you use Hulu or Amazon? I mean, I even heard Coinstar, who owns a lot of the DVD boxes at the supermarkets, grocery stores, the the people that own those boxes is the Coinstar people. They're going to start a streaming site to compete with Netflix. Now, I've been watching Netflix, and like the price increase, I can only I can see agreeing with it if they'll fucking add more movies and promise to rotate the movies more often. I mean, they have a long list of movies. And there's a lot of you know different things on there. I'll admit I got to see some movies on Netflix that I missed at the theater or even when they came out on DVD, but. Like, you can only watch from Paris with Love so many times. I've tried to find Training Day on there, uh, Man on Fire, just a couple of Denzel movies. Like, even old movies like uh, Urban Cowboy, I tried to find, uh, what was the Patrick Swayze movie, Roadhouse. Like, it wasn't on there. I found it on, on YouTube, uh, of all places, believe it or not. So, that's today's one question of the day. Where do you watch your movies at? You'd be surprised there's a few movies on YouTube. Uh, there's a great copy version of Tombstone on YouTube. So where do you watch your movies at? I guess Netflix and YouTube. And honestly, if I had to pay for Netflix, uh, for that price increase, I, I would definitely want a, a bigger variety than they have now. This is what I think. You know, if you, I can understand them wanting more money, but they should put the money towards making Netflix better because they have competition. Fucking Coinstar is coming, Netflix. Like, you know, Netflix has been around for a while. Coinstar has been around for a while, but not in the movie business except for the DVDs. How would it look for Netflix to get palmed, as people like to say on the internet, by Coinstar and streaming movies? Like, Coinstar streaming movies. That shit would be really funny. So, do you, today's one question today. Do you use Netflix? What do you think about the price increase? Are you going to pay it? Do you not use Netflix? And if you do use it, are you going to pay the higher price? Or are you going to switch to somebody else? And like I said, I watch my movies, I do use Netflix, I watch them on there, and I watch them on YouTube. HBO On Demand is not too bad either. Sometimes it'll give uh, Netflix a run for its money on their live streaming. Just saying. All right, this is One Question a Day. I am Pete Moss. I will see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to check out this week's Torment Tuesday. It was uh, pretty funny. It's called Haircut. It's on the Pete Moss Show. All right, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.